Hello everyone and welcome back to your channel Technical Sahil. In today's video, we are going to see that how we can connect a domain from Namecheap or any other registrar to the dream host web hosting. I am creating this video because uh, when I have taken the hosting from dream host, so I got to know that their panel is, they are not using a panel like cPanel or Plex. Instead of that, they have a different custom built panel. Uh, like hosting so when I have created when I have purchased that plan so I got to know that that the interface is quite different so I did some research uh, to figure out how we can connect a domain to the hosting to this hosting and created few domains so I thought it's good to make a video over this so that it will save some time of others so for example I have this uh, domain fiber dot uh, for fiber seller tools dot com right now if we see it's not connected to any hosting as you can see on my screen it's showing name cheap registrar page which is default so in this video we will create we will add the website on dream host and connect this domain with the hosting first we need to uh, log into our dream host panel and after that go to websites and click this manage websites After that, we need to click this add website and we need to select the option from these among like enter your domain name, create a subdomain and register a new domain. This option will point us to the dream host registration domain registration page. And this is for the subdomain. But right now we are uh, looking to connect this domain. So I have to select this option, enter your domain name. And I will copy the same domain name from here and paste it here after that we need to click add yes it says fiber seller tools is registered with another provider yes i confirm i am the owner of this domain next we need to click this uh, hosting right now i have only one plan it's uh, showing me only this plan so i have to select the only plan i have and i need to click setup website It's taking some time to uh, provisioning this and adding the website. So till then we have to wait. When the processing is done, so we need to click uh, this DNS and here we need to copy these uh, records by clicking here. We need to add here custom DNS and we need to paste the first record. Now we need to copy the second record and paste it here. Now we need to click this add name server and we need to copy this third record and we need to paste it here after that we need to click this save icon or button you can say it says dns server update may take up time up to 48 hours to take effect but it won't take that much time especially in case of the domain which was not already in use so if we refresh dns so you can see the DNS propagation has been uh, done. If we again check. Currently, it's showing us the same uh, Namecheap page, 
that means we have to wait a bit more it's saying propagated but uh, your site DNS records have been updated worldwide but right now it's not so we have to wait a uh, one or two minutes more DNS has been refreshed now if we again uh, try to check so you can see it has connected with our hosting and that's how we can connect any domain registered for any provider uh, to this dreamhost hosting so that's all for this video and thank you so much for watching it till the end